when you're rich and when you're poor. I got the moves. I got the moves. Oh, I'm making moves. It's a Monday. Lord, Lord's here with us all. Hey, what's up? Say what's up to the people, man. The people want to talk to you. You know what I'm saying? Hi, people. Hi, people. That's what she said. That's crazy. I can't oh, call them man. Coop's Corner, but that's you. That is. The viewers of Coop's Corner. The viewers. Just you people. and the viewers. Me and the viewers. These are people shopping on a Monday, I guess. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of, it's kind of crazy. I don't got my cards on me, man. Me neither. I gotta start bringing them with me. You know? A lot of people in the little area, like on the side. Very, I, very awkward space, and I have a headache. I, I, I'm not trying to deal with people right now. Like, I'm just trying to do what I need to do here. Go to Walmart. See, always up at this place. It's good. So, like, you start school now? Yeah. You're going back to school, guys. Get your education. That's kind of crazy, man. Like, so that's just that's just extra money, though. More money. More money. You should go to school. It's cold, man. Like, y'all see the way I'm dressed up. I am freezing right now. I am not warm. It's warm outside. I'm gonna go. This is where we part ways. It's killing me on that arm, yo. Couldn't even do it. Yeah, about to come up to H and M, see what they got. I swear it's like I'm here like all the time. Forever at H&M. Let's see if they got this shirt on. It's basic, man. Got the brown shoes. I'm chilling. Okay, this show, we're gonna hit up uh, Walmart. He's still downstairs. Always taking forever to do something. It's like my second home. <laughs> I can check it out. Hey, follow me. Sub to me, guys. Smile. You gotta find Lauren right now. I have no idea where she's at. What are these? It's a bun bag. It's like a donut. Oh, nuts. She a fashion killer, and I'm a trendy nigga. I said her fist to go. Lauren, let me carry her bag. Thanks, Lauren. Little does she know, I'm about to leave. I drove. Oh, dang. The Virgin Mary reincarnated. You can consider me the Virgin Mary. My head is killing. Offset. Records on records, got Beckys on Beckys. I'm riding around in the cool. What's going on, y'all? It is a Saturday. A little bit gloomy right now. Up here at the post office, about to pick up a package. Uh, then I got to make a couple stops after that. Nothing major going on, but I thought I'd take y'all along for the ride. So let's get in here. It looks packed. I really do not feel like being at the post office, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Let's go. All right, y'all. I hope this line ain't too long, man. Let's get up in here. And the line is like a hundred miles long. Jesus Christ. Pray for me, y'all. I think I should have got here early, yo. This line is crazy. Too crazy. Right now. Post office chronicles. Man, that line was crazy. I got what I needed though. <laughs> Look at how I parked my car at the back. Kind of crooked. I know my box cutter is purple, people. Don't judge me. Come on. <laughs> Let's get into it. I know how to use this thing. Kids, when using a box cutter, be very careful. This is very dangerous. Be careful. What do we have here? Oh, I think I know what this is. It's time to go wireless, baby. Got the Apple AirPods. I think I'm about to crack these bad boys open now. I got these because I'm tired of having wires. Like, wires get in my way. You know what I'm saying? Like, and we're in like a wireless world. I love how Apple packages their stuff. It's just so white and just clean. So it comes in like a little pod. Futuristic. How do you open it? Huh, take the plastic off. Duh. Oh, pop the top on them. It's kind of crazy. Is it looking to pair already? Like I just cracked them open and I think it's trying to pair. Connect. 
Oh, that's crazy. Y'all see that? Jackson's AirPods. And they came charged already. That's dope. Now let's see what the sound quality is like. R. Oh, man. Then they make a sound when they're in your ear. It's kind of crazy. One nigga pop it with a pocket full of cottage. Woo, chemo, sabe, chopper, aim it at your noggin. Had to cop the out it, then the top I had to chop it. All right, y'all, up here at Walmart right now. About to. I got a couple pickups I gotta make, you know what I'm saying? Like, just like order some stuff. Cause, like, it's about to be warm again, so I need some stuff in order to clean my car. Uh, picked up some towels and uh, towels and um, some Febreze from my car, too. So, uh, that should be cool. What else did I get? There's something else I got. I forgot. I had like a brain fart. But, um, yeah, about to walk up in here now. See what's going on. Lauren needs some uh, some stuff for her head. Like, she has like a headache. So, so how do y'all feel about Walmart? Like, this store is always just so ghetto and packed. Like, it's crazy. I'm trying to see where's the pickup. Pickup. Over here. I love pickup. Saves you time. I think I'm going in the right direction. Pick up, pick up. That was nice. They gave me a bag of candy with my order. Vlog life, man. It's it's different. You know what I'm saying? Like it's crazy out here. For real, for real. It's like, <laughs> See that dude just looking right there. So that was Walmart in a nut shell. What's going on, Dad? What's up, man? <laughs> to, the, to the smallest spot over yeah. here. Well, I saw it on top, but I wanted that other one. Was that you in front of me? Yeah, I, I was like telling you to uh, oh, okay. go in this spot. What's up, man? What's going on, man? Thank you. Yeah, they were like, put your dad back on there. I was like, all right, here he is, dude. You know the Kevin Love got injured, right? Love it. Six weeks. Well, you said they wasn't playing like shit, no. They wasn't, but still, I mean, we don't want him getting injured. No, that's true. What's the matter with him? Uh, something with his knee, I think. Six weeks. Six weeks. How are you doing? Good, yeah, how are you? Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Thank you. Thank you. Do you want your hot coffee, my dear? Uh, the decaf. Decaf coffee? Yeah, and ice water. And, and I know what I want, so I might as well go and order it. Eight of uh, the smoke wings. We'll put that glaze on it. Just the glaze? Yeah. And uh, green good. beans. That's what I'm getting. We have broccoli. Oh, you don't have green beans. Okay, broccoli and uh, coleslaw. And a warm bun? Yes, sir. Do you have a warm bun? Yeah, is that something new? Because you didn't use that. We used to give you like the little breath the. Uh, That's not the garlic thing you're talking about. No. Right? No, no, I don't he just wants the regular traditional bun. Yes, a bun. Yeah, well, give me With two bun. up. Two bun. Yep. And uh, I wonder if I could get any. Uh, can you make me a, a half orange juice and half cranberry juice to drink? Yeah. Half orange oh, and along half with cranberry. the decaf in the water? Yeah. Right. Absolutely. You want to do orange juice? Half orange and, and half cranberry juice. Absolutely, my dear. Thank you. And for you, too? Oh, and give me the check for all this. Absolutely. Thank you. Right. I'm going to do the eight smoked wings with fries and baked beans. Baked beans? Our baked beans are very good. I'll have eight smoked wings. Eight smoked wings? Same as my dad. Uh, fries and macaroni and cheese. When you get older, you you know you gotta take care of yourself. You know, young people can get away with that shit, you know, because young people don't don't give a fuck about nothing. And 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 they luck up and get a little age on them, and then they start thinking about it. Damn. Yeah. But when you start getting some age on, you gotta take care of yourself, man. You know? was spoiled. Cause you had your mom, you had Auntie Elena, you had Cora, <laughs> and you had your dad. <laughs> so you was just the baby at all. I didn't thing. bother nobody or nothing. You know, I mean, you know, I wanted to kind of be bothering nobody, but sometimes you you want to cause bullies and shit. Yeah. 
Corey said, you can, you, can, you can be a bully all you want to, but you better leave my brother alone. Right. Because if I hear that you mess with my brother, because she'll sneak up behind you and hit you in the head with a baseball bat. Oh, God. <laughs> he's frankly good. You think he's funny, Lauren? Corey Holcomb? Some things he says are really funny, but then sometimes he's just, it's like an ignorant type of funny. Hey, baby, what kind of person is that you got? Is that a coach? You say assistant coach. You got the referee version in this motherfucker. Came with a whistle, goddamn. It's the game Bill Walton is calling. You remember Bill Walton? Yeah, Bill Walton. He the funniest announcer, man. He be high. <laughs> he be high doing that stuff, man, because he be calling players Snoop Dogg and stuff. Like, he was like, look at Snoop out there. Like, what? <laughs> Walton, Walton didn't even want to wear shoes on the court, <laughs> was, Yo, that's put, my favorite dude. He put bro. shoes on, man. He <laughs> said, I won't play with no shoes. He said, I ain't never played with no shoes, so why would I play now? Let's, man, you better put them damn shoes on. In the NBA. In the this NBA. Now, NBA. this little joker didn't want to put on no shoes. <laughs> He's talking about the country. He's, He's a legend, man. In the country. What school did he go to? Where did Bill Walton go? UCLA. Did he go to UCLA? He went to UCLA. So I don't know if he wore shoes at UCLA or not. <laughs> but, but he came to them and said, I ain't wearing no shoes, man. I, I ain't used to wearing no shoes. That's the best announcer. <laughs> Hands down. That's some funny shit. <laughs> This one didn't want to put on no shoes. And got the biggest peak, got about 14th or 16th or some shit. That's why you don't want to wear them. Yeah. Oh man, that was the funniest thing. Made him get, put some shoes on. So they said, man, you can't play in the NBA without no shoes on. The NBA. <laughs> Patty. No. Uh, you, can, you can take this back and give it to somebody that wanted it, because I don't want this stuff. Okay, honey. All right. I would have just moved it to the side. <laughs> and she had about six or seven of them. I don't know. Ah, damn, what's, what's, you know? You want some coffee in your cream? You know what I'm saying? Some people use a lot of creamer. Like, you know, yeah, I know. Some people <laughs> fill their cup up halfway yeah, with creamer. Yeah, people put creamer. Yeah. I mean, they don't want no coffee. They want cream. <laughs> Looks good, guys. Wow. Waiting on the sides now. Did you get another side or no? I got fries. You got what? Right. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is it good, Dad? It's good. That's lunch right there. That's going to be so good. Lauren got her lunch. Dad killing it. He on his, he on his last wing, boy. <laughs> <laughs> don't be taking no shit home. Man. Hey, you know what you did that was funny, man? What? You threw away like a piece of my shoe. When? On Super Bowl day. Like like my like Jordan, like like the little wing on like the you side of my shoe. How did I get a piece of your shoe? Because it was it was an old shoe, so like so like a piece of it fell off and you like looked at the ground like what is this? Yeah, what the fuck is this? And you just threw it away. I'm like, damn, like I couldn't even say nothing. I'm like You should have said something. I was like, F it, it didn't matter. I didn't know I was throwing away your shoe. <laughs> Oh, this is good. Man. Did you see me throw it away? I did. That's what made it funny. Why didn't you say something? I was just like in shock. I was like, did this really fall off my shoe like that? And then you just looked down at it like, oh, oh well. <laughs> I didn't know. Well, he didn't even say he just got up and he was finished with his pizza. Walked over to my table yeah. and just started eating. He didn't say anything. He didn't say, yeah. He had one in his mouth and then asked me if he can have one. <laughs> <laughs> well, Jay be eating whatever he be eating. Did you hear him over here? After he finished eating his food, he asked, me, "Can I have one?" Yeah, can you? Yeah, yeah. And I said, "No." And he said, Cause "You gonna finish your fries?" <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's why I told her bring some more fries because you over here. Yeah, I was like, I hope somebody says something because he's not about to say something on my. You ain't gonna have nothing for your lunch. <laughs> nah, I'm saving it. He been ate up everything for your lunch. <laughs> and then have a whole lunch. And then himself. he got his own lunch. That's all he's thinking about it is. That's for you. What the hell was your lunch? If I said I was full, I wouldn't have any. <laughs> yeah, he said, the hell was your lunch? I got my lunch. <laughs> 
got these something green every day. So I got this black. It's really good. Good. Something green every day. Oh yeah. The greener it is, the better it is for you. Does green candy count? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, Dad. All right, my man. See ya. Talk to you. Drive safe, man. I will. I will.